coming into your YouTube airwaves, it's Vaughn, the Stat Man, and welcome to the Stat Room. All right, guys, so before I get into this video, I want to apologize for the past two days. My phone was out. I was in an area with bad service. I didn't get any kind of reception for the past two days, and thank you for the people that checked on me because it's not like me to not send the lineups out. If that ever happens, I am going through a situation. All right, so with that being said, let's start the video. Happy New Year's DFS community and welcome to the stat room. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I wanted to do this video for tomorrow's slate, guys. We have a nice little slate on tap, guys. We have Boston at Detroit, Memphis at Charlotte, Miami at Dallas, Atlanta at Brooklyn, Washington at Minnesota, Lakers at San Antonio, Chicago at Milwaukee, Phoenix at Denver, the Clippers at Utah and Portland at Golden State. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so before I get into this slate, guys, I would appreciate it if you hit that like button and also subscribe. If you're watching me for the first time, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss future videos. If you've been subscribed to me for the past three years, this is a new channel. So just hit the subscribe button just to be on the safe side. All right, guys, so, so guys, let me introduce myself, guys. I am Vaughn the Statman. You can follow me on Twitter, Vaughn the Statman. And guys, check out the website, VaughnTheStatman.com. All right, guys, so let's get right into this video, guys. All right, at point guard, you got Westbrook at Minnesota. I like that matchup. I think Westbrook will get you about 48 points. Um, I'm loving Stephen Curry in this matchup. Um, I think he's going to do extremely well. Young is probable in this matchup. Kyrie Irving is in a good matchup. This is a slate, guys, where you have to... If you if 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 you don't your your lowest player tonight has to get 30 points, guys. So you selecting your lineups, you can't have no 20 point guys because you will lose. You're gonna need three guys that's gonna get you 50. You're gonna need guys that can get you 40. You're gonna have to really, really do your work. I'm about to once I finish this video, guys, I'm about to really get into this slate. And I'm gonna I'm put up at least a three between a 360 and a 420 tomorrow. I'm gonna really, really get into this. I'm gonna, while, while everybody else is out partying, I'm gonna get into this slate and um, I'll post my results tomorrow. All right, guys, so for the point guard that I'm going to give, guys, I'm gonna give you guys, this is gonna shock everybody with the point guard that I'm gonna give you guys. But I am actually gonna give you guys Trey Burke. And the reason why I'm gonna give you Trey Burke, I, I believe Miami is a superior team to this team and Miami has, they just have they have five solid players, and Doncic is a is a non-start right now. He's not gonna get you 40 fantasy points. His shot is off, and without Porzingis, he's he just doesn't have enough around him. So I think Miami's gonna get up big, and I think Burke is gonna play the whole fourth quarter, and he's gonna play you know during the course of the game. I expect Burke to put up 30 points, guys. All right, at the shooting guard position, I am going to give you guys. This is my this is my actually my favorite play on the slate, guys. I'm giving you McCullum. Um, Golden State doesn't have Klay Thompson. And when Klay Thomas was actually in this lineup, he gave McCullum fits. But without Klay Thomas, you're gonna put Wiggins on him. That's not a good matchup. I think McCullum goes for 55 in this matchup. I see him putting up 50 plus in this matchup. I see him going crazy with assists. I see him getting a couple rebounds, a steal here and there, but I see him putting up 30 actual points. All right, at the small forward position, guys, you know, you got LeBron, good matchup. You got Kawhi, great matchup. Durant, great matchup. I'm giving you guys Gordon Haywood. I think Gordon Haywood is going to be right along the lines with all of the top three players. I think Haywood puts up 45. I think LeBron going to get you 42. I think Leonard's going to get you that right around that 48 to 51 mark. And I think Haywood is going to get you about 45. All right, guys. And last but not least, the boomstick player of the night is Jokic. Aiden is a pretty good defender, ladies and gentlemen. He is a very solid defender, but he is a solid defender around the rim. And Jokic actually is going to stretch him out. He's going to shoot tray balls. He's going to pass the ball. I don't think Aiden's going to be able to match him. Aiden matches up better with guys like Drummond, 
guys that don't shoot the, the, the three-point shot. I don't think he's going to match up well at Jokic. Don't be shocked if Jokic gets you 70 in this matchup. I think Jokic is going to break the slate. All right, guys, so that's it. You got Jokic, Haywood, McCollum, and Burke. All right, guys, so that's it, guys. I am on to break down the rest of the slates, and it is 11.04. Guys, I am actually in Atlanta. I'm about to go to sleep, guys. I am tired. Um, I'm going to go to sleep probably around 1 o'clock. I'm going to break the slate down. I'm going to spend like an hour and 50 minutes breaking the slate down. Then I'm going to go to go to bed because I am tired. But I got to get my work done first. The DFS community is counting on me. So that's it, guys. I am on to break down the slate, guys. So don't forget to win-win. That means give people what they want so you get what you want. And, guys, don't forget to think and ink. That means write it down so that way it can come true. And happy New Year's to everybody. And I hope everyone that's watching this video can bring in the new year with a big-time win. Love you guys.